I nominated my mum because I think she doesn't get the recognition she deserves. She works with the homeless and a lot of autistic children. Countless hours unpaid to make sure that they get all their needs seen to. Becky, despite all of the bad things that have happened to her, the positivity that she displays gives our children, myself and those around her, a really positive role model. Between floods that devastated our community, then COVID, Jessica has just been central to the response and raising thousands of pounds to support flood victims and so on. She is just Wonder Woman who makes Pontypridd magic. Victoria works as a veterinary nurse. She's always thinking of everyone before herself. She's always so caring. That just to have a day where things can be about her, I just say thank you. Thank you. It's not often that I am stuck for work. But thank you so much. I'm amazed, absolutely amazed. Your courage and strength is clear to view, so this celebration, Victoria, is just for you, Dan. Thank you. Dearest Jess, I can think of no one more deserving of being recognised and thanked on International Women's Day, and I'm in awe of all that you do. The awful gallon here, Liv. Bex, my real life wonder woman. <laughs> I am so grateful for everything you do for us all, and I'm so proud of the woman you are. The sacrifice you make really doesn't go unnoticed. Yours forever, man. All your hard work and effort never goes unnoticed. You've, you're our superhero. Thank you for being you. Oh, oh that's incredible. My children. Speak to us really a bit overwhelmed. I don't think anybody's ever said such lovely things about me before. I don't think I've smiled genuinely like this for a long time, honestly. Very touched. And uh, I will treasure this. <laughs>